What's up, bitches? Ladies and gentlemen, it is, without question, the greatest sports and entertainment event of all time. I'm not a racist. I'm going to slap your real mother across the... Hello, boys. <laughs> I think LeBron's a dork. So that is why I am better than everyone in the world. Kiss my ass and suck my dick, everyone. It's a shame that he doesn't know what he's talking about. The cherry strike, where the chin is dry, but the pussies are flowing. Always remember, if you ain't first, you're last. I'm the best in the world. It's an end is justice. I myself, I jerk off at least twice a day. Because I've got nothing here. You're giving me baseball and hockey, and i got my keister blowing in the wind. I have nipples, Greg. Could you milk me? This is serious. I just sharded. But this is a big fucking day. Way to go, guys. If you smell what the rock is cooking. Welcome to the charity strike. And now the guys who put the ooh back in. Hey, stop drooling while staring at my tits, you asshole! Trigger Mike, Midlife Crisis, and Rebound. Oh, yeah. Hey, that's us. Hey. Whoops. Wow. This is weird not having headphones on. It is. Welcome to the show, everybody. It's Charity Strike, but when we're done, pff, it'll be the Charity Stroke. <laughs> <laughs> Kiss me every time. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, welcome to episode 200. We have people staring at us this time. It's very awkward. It is very <laughs> Wow. <laughs> yeah. All two of you. Thank you. And they're not wearing uniforms with guns. <laughs> I know. It's amazing. <laughs> it's, it's very strange. And let us out. Thank you, sir. <laughs> oh, good night, everybody. <laughs> oh, God. Welcome in the show. Episode 200, like we said. It's going to be big, it's going to be bold, and it's going to be not like Trigger Mike's penis. Uh, anyways. It's suitable, though. <laughs> it gets the job <laughs> it done. It gets the job done. It does get the job done. It's cute. We got a little bit of feedback and going Yelp, on. Yelp, I don't have any one ratings at all. One star is nowhere to be found. One and a half and above, my friend. Mm-hmm. One and a half and above. That's about as long as it is, yes. Uh, that's right. Anyways, I am Greg Rebound Jones, sitting with me, Trigger Mike. Pew, pew. And uh, looking old as ever, midlife crisis. What's up, bitches? <laughs> That's right. Uh, you guys feel free to make a little noise if you want. Don't worry. Thank you. Who, me? Oh, them. <laughs> How much did you pay him? It's my Japanese whore. That guy really likes She'll you. She'll do anything yeah. I say. He has a really high voice. Mm-hmm. It's, uh, it's a little strange, actually. He, I told her to. <laughs> or him, too. Him. Let's, let's not fuck this up. No. <laughs> yeah, please. Yeah. Uh, anyways, uh, episode 200, like I said. For those of you listening live on the interwebs, you can get us at thecharitystrike.com, facebook.com, slash charitystrike, and at the charity strict, no E at the end, because da, da, we, were, da, da, da. we were drunk when we signed mm. up. A lot. Uh, anyways, let's get into uh, the sports news. Before we do, I just want to mention we have a few friends hanging out with us. Oh, they left. Wait, That's no, your guys' uh, fucking a- cue! <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it, it's not. It's, um, it's really not. As soon as we started the show, they all walked out. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, it's weird how that happens. <laughs> and we got some people calling in at some point if I ever unlock the phone lines. <laughs> uh, so anyways, let's get right into the sports news. You love basketball. You love basketball. And say yeah. Yeah. Now they get into it. Right, there's there's yeah. one. Thank you, Ru- uh, Breaking news, everybody. Breaking news. Breaking. Byron the music. Who? Well, I got this news? music. Oh, okay, sorry. Byron Scott and the Lakers just uh, came to an agreement on a four-year, $17 million contract. Finally yeah. got a coach. Are there any Laker fans out there? All right. Oh, one of you, yeah. <laughs> the rest of you Thank jump you. ship to the Clippers. Thank you. <laughs> I don't blame you whatsoever. Uh, who's talking to you? Okay. Uh, <laughs> 
<laughs> Anyways, uh, the best move the Lakers have made in at least, what, two years? Uh, since uh, the D'Antoni era. Oh, that's my favorite era. Yeah. Yeah, that's depressing. So let's slit our wrists and, and reflect on the D'Antoni era. But let's, yeah. I, I'm depressed. Okay. Uh, anyways. Uh, well, they, they put the team together without a coach. I was beginning to wonder at the beginning of the season if the Mitch and Jimmy Buzz going to sit up there. You know, I just keep thinking I forgot something. I can't can't put my finger on it. And then we got Kobe for it? There you go. Okay, thank you. You guys yes. shouldn't be su- too surprised. Uh, Byron Scott joins any team that's shitty, so it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> he makes it better. <laughs> yes. Yeah, and then somebody else gets all the credit for it, so it's okay. Yeah, and honestly, D'Antoni didn't raise the bar very high for him. Not really, time. no. Uh, though we do have the new big three. <laughs> <laughs> Who are they? Big three what? Kobe. His Achilles tendon. His Achilles. No. Kobe. Jeremy Lin and Carlos Boozer, the big three. Oh, yeah. Boozer. That's right. All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How is that not the big three? We do have an Asian crowd out here. How do you guys feel about Jeremy Lin being in town? <laughs> <laughs> Don't even care, right? No, no, right. no. He's too white for you guys, oh, too, right? Oh, man. That- <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hello, everybody. <laughs> oh, is that good? Okay, fine. Uh, Kobe's going to be in a new documentary. Anybody care about Kobe documentaries? Oh, I do. Okay. That's the one. Okay. <laughs> All right. It's going to happen. Uh, and he's going to talk about um, Kobe stuff, about being injured and all that good shit. Oh, I can't wait to read here. Is it going to be on TV or what? It's a documentary. That means it's like a movie or something. A movie? Yeah. Did they have to cut out a lot of footage because he was injured all year? Right. So it's, it's, is, is it going to be a pay-per-view? It's going to be real slow. It's going to be <laughs> real, real slow. slow. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a Kubrick <laughs> film, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, Breaking news, Bynum is going to take next year off. Oh, no way. <laughs> Isn't that kind of like the last three years? <laughs> He's going to go to Germany and get the Kobe procedure. And they opened up some new bowling lanes there. Yeah. He's going to go check them <laughs> out. By Kobe procedure, I, I don't mean fucking white chicks in the ass. <laughs> uh, he, apparently, he's going to do the new knee thing, and then uh, he's going to come back next year and be ready to get the time new contract. Yeah, Kobe, it takes a couple months. Uh, Bynum, it takes a full season. Right. I think it's because no team is interested in him, though. It's well, my only opinion. Yeah, no shit. Yeah. <laughs> Bynum. <laughs> he's Bynum. He's, he's a great bowling partner. Uh, the Cavs have officially signed Andrew Wiggins to a rookie contract and uh, probably trade him <coughs> in a month when they're, oh, hey. You're welcome. <laughs> welcome to 200, It wouldn't everybody. be TCS without that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Can I have a napkin, please? <laughs> please. Uh, you may need a trash bag. <laughs> he needs to jerk off to his own burp. Don't get him wrong, guys. Don't get him wrong. Wait, you don't? <laughs> I jerk off to his burps. <laughs> Jesus. At my age, it's once a day and I'm done. Oh, there it is. Uh, Andrew Wiggins signed uh, to the Cavs. It'll be no time at all when he's uh, signed to the Minnesota, Minnesota. Timberwolves. Yeah. yeah, they get 30 days of trying to figure <laughs> out the, uh, the the deal of the terms of the uh, actual trade. It's just weird trade. sitting down, by the way. I'm gonna it, it's, it's weird hearing the feedback, too. It, it, it's weird hearing the feedback, and it's weird sitting down. I'm going to stand up like a weirdo. So the Cavs actually might be able to do a good trade if they can get 30 days Thank and you. put it all together. So. Maybe. Maybe. I mean, they're they're dealing with Dan Gilbert. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> if they don't burn any Kevin Love jerseys. Oh, thank you. That that's so much better. Jenny O moving the speed <laughs> out there. Uh, Jameer Nelson. Good news, everybody. Jameer Nelson signs a deal with the Mavs. Two years. The Mavs. <laughs> two years. Two point seven million. Two point seven three actually. And he gets to fuck Dirk Nowitzki's mom. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. Is that like the, the LeBron mom deal? Wasn't that Nelson who fucked LeBron's mom? No, it was, uh, what the hell? Dante oh, West. It was, it was oh. that crazy guy. Now the I Monte feel stupid. West. Sorry. Now I feel I forgot Delonte. Delonte in there. Delonte. Yes. Yeah, they look the same. Because <laughs> they're that's black? Ra- that's oh, racist. Wow. Jesus whoa, Christ. Whoa, whoa. I thought we'd how, be in the second how, block before we how, got racist. How dare you? I'm not a racist. <laughs> uh, the, <laughs> the Bucks have picked up Kendall Marshall. Ooh. So the Lakers lose another player. So the Lakers are just fucking themselves. <laughs> I, why did we get rid of him? I thought he did good. Oh, no, wait. I just That's, answered my own yeah. question. Never thank mind. Thank you. Thank you. He may have had too many assists, scored too many points, Probably. and played too many games. He'd make yeah. Byron Scott look too good, and he wouldn't get fired in he, three years. He played so. better than Nash, and they don't like that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, he played better well, than the played. white guy. He played, is what you mean. Now, what I heard is, is Nash in his contract had some shit where it's like, you play six games, and your contract's valid for the year we pay you. That's about what he's going to play, right? And, and he, I think you played like seven or eight games this year. <laughs> he just oh, made wow. it. Good uh, for him. Just made it, just to fuck us over. Uh, what else is happening? LeBron was voted the most popular athlete, everybody. No way. Who likes LeBron? LeBron. Uh-oh. Oh, Not nobody. Not TCS, apparently. Oh, nobody. He's a dork. That Japanese prostitute would suck his dick, though. He would. You know, we should have just played it. Le- we have the LeBron Watch 2014 music. My whole point with LeBron James is that he just needs to be quiet. I think LeBron's a dork. He is. Thank you, Chael. Mm-hmm. Uh, LeBron is a dork. LeBorn. 
<laughs> <Little boring. laughs> For those of you who don't know, used to work at a Chinese TV station. One of the girls refused to say LeBron after we tried to correct her politely. Say, hey, it's his name was LeBron. She go, I know, LeBorn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Uh, Donald Sterling. Oh wait, I think we have something for Donald Sterling. Don't we have something these days for Donald Sterling? If I just keep talking long enough, maybe I'll find it. <laughs> you didn't have it queued, huh? Yeah, there it is. Thanks, Dick. Hey, I found it, asshole. I spent 10 minutes on it. Oh, wow. Shut up. This is horrible. He's racist. Donald's racist. Sterling's racist. Yes, he's racist. To call that good karaoke, sir, that's a so not true. <laughs> yeah. mm-hmm. So not true. I am a genius. Mm-hmm. Sure, why not? Mm-hmm. Uh, so Donald Sterling, first, he, uh, he, need, he apparently needs to tell the team because he owes $500 million in loans. What? What? According to his CFO. Wow. Uh, he's also bet with Steve Ballmer, who bought the team. And then uh, Shelly Sterling and Adam Silver, he's now filed lawsuits against, <laughs> as of like the other day. And, so what's his thought today? And to add, add it all up, if he stays around, Doc and CP3 are gone. It's okay. CP3 wouldn't show up in the playoffs anyway. So. Right. It's okay. Yeah, he never shows up. Never he shows pulls up in the pain. playoffs. No, here's the deal. If he drags this thing along, <laughs> everything will be gone. <laughs> Are you saying it's that big? <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I don't understand why he's a racist. He's white and Jewish. I, and he, he lost his foreskin at birth. <laughs> he's so I don't think it's that long anymore. It's long but trim. But, uh, yeah, if he drags this thing along, he's going to lose. It's, it, the Clippers will be a joke like they used to be. Because well, nobody wants to play, nobody wants to stay. Well, the the Lakers helped them out not being a joke anymore. So let's not get that wrong. Well, right they can now. all go to the Lakers, <laughs> please. Well, this whole Chris Paul thing. Have you guys heard about the Chris Paul thing? Yeah. He says he's not going to play. I heard about it, Chris Paul's thing. Yeah, yeah. It's about nine inch. Uh, that wheel drag. That's sure. Yeah. <laughs> You're telling me. <laughs> this guy's short. Uh, anyways, he says he won't play if Donald Sterling is still uh, the owner of the team. The problem with that being is where was that come playoff season? Like, oh, hey, the playoffs, Don Sterling's still the owner, and he said these horrible things. Let's sit out now. You know, take a stance. But mm-hmm. now that everyone said their piece and, yeah. and they're, they're going through the trial, now he's like, oh, I'm not going to play. Oh, okay. Way well, to jump on board, Dick. Didn't he, didn't he or maybe somebody else that said, I'll, I'll honor my contract, but once it's up, if he's around, I'm not going to resign. Did he say that? I, I thought it was him. Could have been one of the other guy. But, you know, a lot of players have said, I won't stay, and a lot of players have said, if he's still the owner, I will not Go to the Clippers. So, yeah. you know. Well, Sterling being a racist isn't new. He got sued in, what, the 80s or 90s for being racist with apartment complexes? Right. So they signed that contract. You should probably play it out or you look like a fucking idiot. True. True. And you know what? They didn't do anything to Sterling at that time because the Clippers were a joke and nobody cared. Now that they're a good team, it's all, right. oh, well, the Clippers oh, are in the highlights. So now that they're worth $2 billion. Now we got to take the high road. Right. Yeah. So, I mean, he needs to get out of there. Um, but, you know, if he's going to be an idiot and drag it along, then. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be the old Clippers that played in the sports arena. Well, as a lawyer, Ooh, he nice. probably will know how to drag it along as well. True. Uh, you guys, this is episode 200, and uh, I think that's enough for basketball for yeah. today. Sorry Why are we that. even talking about real sports anyways? Uh, I figured we'd bring in an, an old friend to the show, if you will. Oh, cool. I like old friends. <laughs> that's all I have is old friends. Because yeah. you're old. That's right. Uh, you may that know are still her. alive, I mean. Right. <laughs> you may know her as Joni O-Face. The rest of us just know her as... Uh, Jenny O-Face. The Japanese whore that we like to do. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my God. I squirted everywhere. Oh, did you break (laughs) it? Okay, we've got clips. We don't need you. We got drops. We've got enough of you on here. (laughs) Is it working? Hello? Oh, no. You broke it. The buzz is going. Is it working now? Can you hear me? Oh! (laughs) Mazel tov. Hold that in place, Greg. Houston? I'm just going to sit. Oh, oh. I'm holding it. Okay. <laughs> I'll hold this cable, too. Just right. for you, Jenny. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Be appreciative. Thanks. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. It's cute. Hi. What's happening? It's been a while. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, thanks This for sounds like me. shit, by the way. I'm sorry for you guys out there in our large studio audience. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, two, it actually is, it is a large two studio Two rows audience. back it here. It's all yeah. three of you. Yeah. Thank you. I love 
Trigger Mike. <laughs> yeah. We all of Suck us. My dick. All Wait, of sorry. us are wearing Trigger Mike T-shirts mm-hmm. because we love Trigger Mike. Mm-hmm. We are his biggest fan club. Did, did you like cut out iron ons? We don't, we don't have Trigger Mike T-shirts. <laughs> no, we made them. Oh, we are the fan club. Wow. We told you, right. we were, yeah, we got them screen popular. printed. Wow. I told you eventually I'd catch on. Yeah, like they're a, professionally like done. How come they're all pink? You, you literally Africa. caught on like AIDS. Yes. Yeah. They're all rainbow colored and everything. We didn't even go beefy tea. Like, we went like good like good quality Hanes. Oh, did you go with the American Apparel? <laughs> no, they're, they're still Hanes. Nobody likes American Apparel. <laughs> That's too expensive anyways. <laughs> wow. Yeah, look at all these people with the, mm-hmm. uh, the Trigger Mike Trigger t-shirts Mike shirts, on. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, guys. Yeah. yeah. On Thank the front, says Trigger we Mike. We love you, Trigger Mike. Thank you. <laughs> Trigger Mike 323 <laughs> on the back says, I suck dick. It's weird. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite as good as midlife shirt. <laughs> I'm sorry well, to hear that. The, mm. the backs of our t-shirts actually say pew, pew, pew. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> pew, 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 323. Uh-huh. Yeah, so I've got a French line out. Le pew, le pew going out there. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, it's good. Yeah. It's le very pew, popular in, in Quebec. <laughs> it hasn't made it all the way across the pond yet. Uh-huh. <laughs> the French are too smart. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah they, 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 we, we should have some next week that say like, Pew pew le Mike. Yes. So. Thank you. Le Mike? Yeah. That never happens. <laughs> <laughs> We're just gonna like combine all of the all of the names in one and make make cool t shirts. Don't do that. Yeah, no, we should. We're, we're we're the fan club. Oh we okay. can do whatever we want. Are you the president? <laughs> no. <laughs> she will not claim Haiku that. Hank is the president. Oh, yeah. say, nobody wants yeah. to claim president of that fan club. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be stoned out of your mind. <laughs> he is. They pay us to actually be a part of their fan club. <laughs> How much do they pay you, by the way? It's not much. <laughs> <laughs> in blowjobs. <laughs> well, you get paid in blowjobs? I wish. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'd have, like, double boners all day long. <laughs> oh, hashtag double boners. Hashtag funny. double boners. Well, thank you for showing up. Yes. Amongst the three people that showed up, Did I passed the mic. No, not yet. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to hold it anymore. I'll, I'll turn you down, and we won't get rid of that buzzing. Because apparently you... You make buzzing noises. <laughs> That's her vibrator. <laughs> Don't get her wrong. Over here. <laughs> She's a Japanese whore. She's very prepared. She really in every situation. Yeah, she really is. But you know, she just wants a dick sometimes. Shit, I just want a dick right now. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you turned your mic down. <laughs> I know. She's loud. <laughs> it's not working. Her dick just or her dick. Her mic is stayed <laughs> open. <laughs> <laughs> she's always one to one. Dose. Yeah. She's, she's always one to one. Oh dear! All right, everyone, pretend you like us for a second. Hey, uh, out there, who uses Amazon? Yeah. Oh yeah. See, that was better than the show opening. That what just cost fuck? me seventy dollars. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you guys gonna use the Amazon? Go to the charitystrike.com. Click on the Amazon banner. It won't cost you anything extra. Just uh, kicks a couple of shillings our way. A couple like of Amazon. ducats. Yeah. If you will. No. Uh, no? What? You won't? Will not. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> or if that's too much work for you because you're a lazy fat fuck. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. You can yeah. go to the Amazon.thechartystrike.com. It's that, it's that fucking easy. Can you do that? Sure, why not? You're a dick. Yeah. My fingers are in good you, shape. You fucking cock. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Ooh, that's how I feel about you. Let's talk a little baseball action. Now there's lots of teams throughout this land, but I'm proud to be a Cubby fan. Believe me, 84 was just the start. We're going to bring a pennant to this park. Hey, I'm a Cub fan. I'm a Cub fan. And I'm a Bud man. I'm a Bud man. Ooh, Holy cow. We'll win the series before we're through. People are laughing. I know it's not the show because it's not that funny. No. <laughs> it's probably a secret joke in the audience. It's probably because I'm standing here like Captain Morgan. <laughs> 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 smells like pancakes right now. Oh, should I just whip my dick out? Would that make it better? I was going to say, it could be because your yeah. fly is down. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you wouldn't see it anyways. Uh, anyways, let's talk a little baseball action. Hey, any Giants fans here today? Oh. Good, because Puig had three triples yesterday, <laughs> you fucking whore. <laughs> you fell for it. Oh. <laughs> She said something. I don't know what. Uh, <laughs> Yasiel Puig, the first Dodger with three triples in one game in 113 years. Wow. Jesus. First Dodger. We huh? must say. First Dodger, we must say. I don't. The Mexican is hating against her own Latino. Yeah, what's uh, up with that? Brother. Well, you, don't, you don't claim Cuba either? Yeah. Maybe what's you're wrong? related. I don't know. What's wrong with Cuba? Oh, oh wow. I see how oh, it is. Too dark for Man. you, huh? Oh, mm-hmm. you jealous of the yeah. nice, delicious skin color? Is that what's happening mm. here? <laughs> wow. <laughs> you look white. You look white. 
she's really taking that racist bit right I now. I know. Wow. Running with it. Daniel's glowing. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel looks amazing. He does. You on the other hand. That tan is beautiful. I know you were born with it, but You oh, look amazing. You look like you haven't stepped out of that Alabama farm in years. <laughs> 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 it's ridiculous. Uh, so go Yasiel Pui. The last person to do it. I'm sure you guys have all heard of this guy. Jimmy Shecker. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Jimmy. All right. Great news, everybody. Yeah, exactly. Thank you. Uh, the Angels have acquired closer Houston Street. Yes, that's his name. Houston Street. Houston Street. Yes. Uh, he's from the Padres, so you know he must be good. Yes. He is absolutely he is. He's happy excellent. about he leaving is. Yeah, the Padres. The Padres yes, don't give away course. anybody that sucks. It's the time Street. of the year for the Padres to get rid of all their good players. They do have that time of the year. Street's yes. gone and uh, Headley. Yep, they got rid yeah, of Headley. They They're just Yankees. rebuilding, guys. Give them 30 years. They'll be fine. <laughs> You really think that's going to happen? That, I don't know. It's San Diego. Who knows? They'll 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 never rebuild. <laughs> yeah, that's true. San Diego and their sticky intersections. They did choose uh, <laughs> River Phillips over uh, Drew Brees. That's a long sport. <laughs> sorry. That's not the Padres. That's the Chargers. Sorry. We're oh, talking sorry. baseball here. Oh, sorry. Stay with the rundown, please. I was lumping please. the cities all oh together. Oh, my God. Jesus. Uh, the Astros. Astros? <laughs> <laughs> Who's got another beer for me? Uh, the Astros have failed to sign the number one draft pick. Only the Astros would fail to sign the number one the draft pick. Only the Astros. Only the Astros. Oh, Troy Tulwitzki is out with a lift, left hip flexor strain. Their power hitter, too. Yeah. Their only hitter. Also yeah. uh, the Cubs have filed a lawsuit against a fake mascot. That is beautiful. That is great. <laughs> he was start- apparently he was starting fights in bars as the Cubs mascot. <laughs> Fake mascot going to bars around the stadium, starting fights with fans. <laughs> Whatever you got, yeah, sure, I'll take that. Whatever you got there, thanks. I was I was half joking about bringing me a beer, but since you're there, just bring me whatever you got in your hand. He does not want the Corona. I'll take a hoe garden. <laughs> yeah, I do. Oh, wow. Let me get my my shovel. Ready. Where's the damn waitress when you need one anyway? Yeah. Where's the beer wench? <laughs> Hold on. Let's see. <laughs> beer wench? Where are you, beer wench? It doesn't come across well as a lie. No, 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 no. Let me promise all of you this recorded sounds very old-timey. Oh, you'll love it. It sounds you'll very old-timey. Old when you hear this back later, it's going to be fantastic oh, and old-timey. That's what I tell everybody. Yeah. 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 And well, then if you get really, really drunk, it'll be funny. <laughs> yes. Yeah, just get hammered. Yeah. This is awful. Uh, the <laughs> Chuck. Oh, my God. Thank you so much. Alliteration Al has uh, <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> I bring tears, bitches! <laughs> <laughs> you stand by over there. You oh, just, he's on. He's ready. You just stand by, my friend. Uh, what else is happening in baseball news? Chuck? No. <laughs> mm, my favorite number. No. no <laughs> mm-hmm. Anybody know his name? Yeah, he's uh, named after a sunscreen. No block. <laughs> no block. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, anyways, he was supposed to be part of the Twins Hall I, of I don't know. I would help you out more, but I can't see the rundown because I was trying to look over here on Trigger Michael's thing, and he's just watching gay porn. So, <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised. It's how I channel my funny. Thank you, guys. By watching. <laughs> yes. Wow. By watching gay porn. Thank you. Oh, whatever works. It for relaxes you. me. What kind of porn are you watching? Gay. <laughs> <laughs> Two super, guys. Like, uh, was it the title? So Oops, now there's three porn. guys. Wait a minute. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Jenny O's into that kind of stuff. You do have two dicks, right? You're used to that type of porn. Right. Mm hmm. <laughs> She's now jerking off her imaginary penis. Pe- oh, excuse me. P and I. There it P&I. is. P and I. Yes. Uh, anyways, that guy I was just trying to pronounce the name of. He was supposed to be part of the Twins Hall of Fame ceremony. Uh, it was scheduled for next month, and then last week he beat his wife. So that's so? been canceled. What was the reason, really? though? The There's wife beating or the Hall of Fame thing? Well, the, the Hall of Fame thing has been canceled. For the Twins, <laughs> not because for Because of the wife beating thing. I don't know what the problem I, is. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Ray Rice only got a couple days of suspension, so. Well, this Who guy. did? This guy gets, loses Hall of Fame. I don't get it. Fucked up. Did the phone just distract you right now? It did. I'm getting <laughs> I'm getting text messages 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 from Scherzer from uh, Adam. Oh, oh, okay. He's trying to call in. He says it's not working. Ah, son of a. That's bitch. what she said. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> heard that before. <laughs> so here, let let's just call Adam. Oh All yeah, right. yeah. Let's. You guys want to make a phone call? Good. Let's let's make a phone call here. We'll probably get his voicemail. Where's our <laughs> Where's our phone call music? There it is. There it is. 
ringing like a true cell phone. Little breaks in between. Yeah, this is great. This is a great pod, everybody. Mm-hmm. This is... Yo. Hello? Adam! Hey. You're a dick. Hey, what? Something wrong with Skype. Oh, blaming Skype again, huh? Yeah, blaming Skype. What's happening, non-Skype person? <laughs> oh, not a whole lot. I'm just enjoying the show. Are you swallowing your phone right now? <laughs> Are you swallowing I right now? A... No, it's actually quite a bit of ways away from my face. Oh, that's a burst. Yeah. Yeah, what's the haps? No, I have a, I have a Note 3. That's kind of hard to do. Oh, those droids. They, no, they no, suck balls. No swallowing no swallowing this tablet. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Would you like a beer? Yeah. <laughs> sure, please. Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> May life is going for beers right now. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the haps, my buddy? I'll take a Belgian. I don't know. I just... I want to, you know, the 200th it's, it's episode. I want to blue and white listen, midlife. I know you can't read. Listen in. Blue and white. What, whatever you do, just don't pay attention to whatever Mike's saying. I'll even turn him down. Looks like this. <laughs> no more. Damn it. <laughs> yes, please. Anything some about about, Corona? Some about episode 200. What? No, I was just. Uh, I remember back in the day when you guys first started this, and uh, you know, we did a podcast, and it was awful. Yeah. And oh, by the what? way, thanks, Al. Yeah. And you, you know what's funny? Your, uh, you know what's funny is the podcast. Your days. Mm-hmm. Oh, wow. the, the podcast is still awful. Nothing's changed. At least it's twisting. It's not twisting all the way off, though. No, I, you're right. Yeah. Our, our, but I have I have some break. I have some exclusive news. Oh, what breaking news? Breaking wait. news. Uh, there will be. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We gotta give you wait, news. Wait, 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 wait. I'm you, sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I think you need breaking news music. Hold on a second. <laughs> Jesus <Okay>. Christ. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Breaking news live from the TCS studios. What's the breaking news? You make it sound so important. Um, well, I finally just, had just for you. I Don't let us down, Adam. Okay. Uh, well, breaking news: I finally had a bowel movement after two days. Oh wow! Oh, yeah. 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 No, that's 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 not the break. That's not it. Um, me, me. <laughs> you're gonna take all my fans out. Does that mean you're no I longer full of shit? That, well, no, I'm completely full of shit. Oh, okay. There's no doubt about yeah. that. Uh, uh, me and Reggie have had a lot of talks. Oh no. And uh, yeah, we've Wait, been, you're, we've you're been, finally uh, coming out. <laughs> we've been disgruntled. No, I've been out for a long time. If you listen to our show at all, you know that. <laughs> no. Thank you. I'm, I appreciate the uh, sentiment. Uh, we're going to have something going on. Uh, <laughs> I thought this, you uh, did already. I bet you are. And we don't know the name of the show yet. We, we talked last week. And, and oh, you're not uh, going to go with the uh, always popular Adam and Reggie show? No. I, I, obviously, my name being first failed the show completely. Oh, it's like that Beatles thing where McCartney wanted his yeah. name first later on. Yeah, it started a fight. <laughs> yeah, so we're going we're gonna to try something. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, we, we were both kind of a bunch of little girls. When we did this, what you were and, having a bunch of little uh, girls? <laughs> yes, you did what to little we girls? Didn't very, we didn't do a very good job of being ourselves. Do you have their numbers? There? I would hope that you're not into little girls. Why? <laughs> not right now. Okay, little boys maybe. I can't talk about that. This is a this is a live broadcast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> should you're we talk incriminating off? yourself right now? Should we talk about you? you? you want to say I mean, I never did anything like that. Waited a month <laughs> off ever in the morning at <laughs> school. <laughs> you know. <laughs> <laughs> and he said he liked boys too. <laughs> I, I I do like the music though. <laughs> it's like it's, it's I like can a, hard, uh, I can hardly hear it, but I know that I'm hearing uh, LMFAO, and that makes me sad. Well, it's like a knockoff. I don't know. This is like hard cider. Oh, okay. <laughs> it is very hard. Cider. Oh but my yeah, god, so Mike got something. big life a hard cider. No, he got. No, it I got him. I thought it was a beer. Oh, what is wrong with you? No, he got I, him hard. I thought it was beer. <laughs> yeah, he got him hard, and there's some cider in the <laughs> yeah, process. Not a hard cider. He got him hard. <laughs> I got him hard with cider. Thank you for clearing that up. Yes. Thank you. No problem. Yeah. So yeah. So something's going to be happening here. We'll get in touch with you guys whenever we record it. But there'll be a little teaser coming. We, uh, we talked last no, week. No, no, no. We'll get in touch with you. Something. So we're having an off-air meeting on the air. Oh, That's great. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. So it'll be happening. Good. Not that anybody cares, but no. And then shut I'm tired up. Of, uh, <laughs> how how doing, dare you? Doing Nobody. nothing. Yeah. All two people Being watching right now. They're fat. they're so bored. <laughs> Well, I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I can take my shirt off, but Skype isn't, you know, I, there's nothing I can do. Doesn't translate? Oh. 
They're still asking you to take it off. There's ladies and men wanting you to take it off right now. Uh, Most, no, mostly nobody men. Wants to see that. There's children. There's children around. Maybe in your house. Well, we got some Snapchat requests. Uh, you could mm-hmm. swat it at us. Snapchat request. <laughs> you could text it to me. I, won't I, show I actually, I actually, ex- I, my my Snapchat is very exclusive. Um, I do a lot of whipped cream tricks, <laughs> uh, coat hanger stuff, <laughs> and uh, like I said before, my. <laughs> Wait, do you say whipped cream tricks? <laughs> <laughs> well, you'll just have to get my Snapchat to find out there, Greg. <laughs> You're right, I my see bad. what that means. You know what? Everyone's mind went to that area, and they're like, well, I wonder what the hell that means. Well, I am now signing I up for Snapchat. I have all my ribs, so don't, so don't be dirty. It's vulgar. It better be dirty. Yeah, they're a little dirty. Yeah. They're a little dirty. Yeah, you make that dirty. But, yeah, so I wanted to congratulate you guys on your thing. And, and I, told Greg, I told Greg the last time I was on there that uh, I thought the uh, – Awkward Apocalypse should have been on, and it's not, and that uh, bugs me. You hear that, Jenny? Oh, he's Jen- calling you out. Jenny's here. He's, he's calling you out. <laughs> she said, all right, I hear you. Yeah. <laughs> it looks yeah. like the look uh, it of bugs me. I, I, did, I did really enjoy that show. You, you hate this show. I don't care for your sports talk at all. You talk yeah. about basketball too much. Wait, did you call me. in here to talk about AA right now? <laughs> you son I'm of just a bitch. Throw, I'm just making the point that I liked it. I thought it was good. And it shouldn't have ended. Uh, that's all. Wow. This show could end at 200, and I'd be okay with that. <laughs> <laughs> How dare that get the biggest pop of the night? <laughs> <laughs> to your credit. Let's talk it, about racing, shall we? Wait, racing? You, you know, Adam, to your, still? Adam or Reggie, whatever your name is, to your credit, <laughs> it could have added, It could have ended at like two, and, and people would have been okay with that. So, No, no. You guys do a good job. Oh, thanks. Thanks I for actually, the lies. But we're up herpes. Here. We're here with you for live. Checks in the mail. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, I signed up live, so now when you have your Saturday shows, I don't know if I'll be able to do Thursdays because, you know, I've got TV shows and stuff to watch. What? Really important things. It's, it's well, called DVR, you, know, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I, I oh, have we're, that, we're a podcast. You can listen to us any time. Wait, wait, hold on. What are you watching, Veep? <laughs> <laughs> That's off for right now. <laughs> no, no. I, 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 Grey's you guys, you guys Anatomy? Yeah. Grey's Anatomy hasn't been on for years, has it? I don't know. It, it, How old are you? Uh, <laughs> men in the crowd are telling me that it's still on. Is it? Fuck, I don't know. That's I don't what guys it. are telling me. It's got to be true. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So, oh, also, I wanted to let you guys know I'm extremely excited for fantasy football <laughs> this year. <laughs> you finally joined the team, Ex- right? Extremely excited. I've got you to finally checked your really mail to join the team, you son of a bitch. Your wife must be so proud. I, I, I'm really excited. I'm going to win, too, by the way. I don't know if you know this. I'm really good at it. I'm going freaking Ocho Cinco first round. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, so. you have got Terrell Owens. <laughs> well, I tried that last time, and it didn't work. Yeah. You know, the problem is, is you guys don't really understand. Really, going kicker first round, it locks you in. Oh, like I'm, I'm you going Phil go Dawson there. for number one pick. Phil Dawson fans <laughs> in the crowd? <laughs> Woo! Nobody, okay, it's good. Just me. It's just nobody, me. nobody, nobody. We got, we got Mike. No one's right. screaming for that. It's four niners. But uh, I'll let you guys go. I know you. I know you have tons of callers lining up yeah. right now. <laughs> yeah, let me tell you. The lines are just. Yeah. Yes. I couldn't They're... get in for fifteen minutes. Beep. Yeah, we yeah, have that's another call. We, oh, we have all the two kids. more calls. Yeah, we have all the kids that want to blame yeah, so. you for raping them on the line right now. <laughs> 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 We're please. recording this for the police. Wait, hold on. You're going please, to jail. Please hold. Is, is this Reggie? <laughs> you know that's not Reggie. Oh. His voice, he sounds like he sounds he sounds like he sounds like a tired turtle. <laughs> that's what he sounds like. A tired. Greg will play turtle. him right now. Hold on one second, like, Adam. Hold on, we, hold on we, one we, second, we Adam. Reggie. This is Reggie. This is Reggie. Maybe I'll do something. Uh, naughty. That's a, uh, that's naughty. a tired <laughs> turtle right there. There's a little Reggie for you. <laughs> no, I, I'm really excited, too, because we talked about, you know, I, I sit there and say how much I, I don't like, you know, political correctness and stuff. And I, I really, I, you know, if you can laugh at one thing, you should be able to laugh at anything, even if it's offensive or not. We talked about this a lot. And, yeah, child rape can be and, funny at times. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> but the whole, <laughs> the whole thing, the whole thing was is that we... <laughs> We needed it. We need. I hear yelling. Who's yelling? That's you know, the rabid fans we got over here. Yeah, we got all two of them. Oh, oh. <laughs> I can tell you right now, for two people in the crowd, it is a very good. 
Yeah, they 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 kind of like turn their heads around, so it sounds like more people. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, they, you know. It's like a siren. <laughs> but we, but me and Reggie both realized that we have the wrong people following us. If we don't allow our families to follow our show, we could be the biggest pieces of shit that there ever was, and they never have to know because I have a lot of respect for my family. Oh wait, and so it, it, wait, I it, it, it gets worse. Myself too much. It gets worse than oh, I already had. You're fucking kidding me. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm young from north, but. You I, just wait. That's all I'm saying. The, the, the conversation we had on the phone okay, last wait. week uh, was pretty was pretty awesome. So what I happened think, there? Did one of the kids just stuff. use their teeth on you? <laughs> huh? Is your nipple hey? okay? <laughs> <laughs> well, I did I did mention about uh, whipped cream play. I believe. Yes. He rapes so. kids that are old enough to have teeth. Mm-hmm. Wow. Wow. Right. Well, anyway, this, this, this is this is completely run out of steam, and nobody's listening. Anyway, <laughs> you're right. No, so, even, even the people I, right in front of us are not listening. So you know, it's a new show, but don't have a name, and our fans are all excited for it. So. Hey, it's gonna be a new show oh, with Adam and Reggie, not called excited. the Adam and Reggie Show. <laughs> no, it's gonna be called not the Charity Strike. <laughs> you get a lot. It's of gonna listeners. be a hit. <laughs> yeah. Oh God! Better, I'll better listen to than that. this. But uh, and this is my this is my full petition to bring back Awkward Apocalypse. Oh, I know God. there are certain ears in the Look room that. that should be hearing this. Start the Twitter campaign and need, right now. I need to do this. Hashtag uh, Greg needs to go to AA. <laughs> oh, <laughs> di- different AA. Sorry. <laughs> All right. So yeah. Well, have fun, everybody. Thank you, Thank sir. Thank you, Adam. Yep. Have a good one. Toodles. <laughs> Toots. <laughs> Toots. <laughs> Fart. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, how dare I not uh, have the fart noise ready? You have too many noises for that board. Yeah, it's right here. Yeah, there it is. Thank you. Toots, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, before we go to break, I would like to have a little showdown. Uh-oh. What? Uh, Mike, if you could take yourself to the bathroom and jerk off some gay porn for a few right. minutes. My dream. I would like to bring in uh, one haiku Hank and an even better one alliteration Al. Do I really have to give up my seat right. for that haiku Hank guy? Yes. All right, fine, I'm gone. Uh, alliteration Al, if you don't know, he's he's mostly from Awkward Apocalypse. I think actually he's only from Awkward Apocalypse. Uh, the I'd like to say the sister show to this show, but really it has nothing to do with this show other than me. Uh, and But he was much funnier than haiku Hank. <laughs> <laughs> Why, you son of a bitch! Yeah, thank you. Uh, and, and in the crowd, we actually have alliteration now. Alliteration now. All right. Yes. Uh, oh, Greggy Jones. <laughs> oh, Daddy O's. <laughs> Haku Hank is here. And alliteration now is also here. Pleasure to be here on the 200th anniversary show of TCS. Don't be jealous, alliteration now. I can fit all my words on a fucking Twitter tweet. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Up yours. <laughs> That's not an alliteration. Not an alliteration. <laughs> uh, so we figured we'd have a, an HH versus AA showdown. I cannot decide who should go first. I am the senior member of the show. I should go first. All right, fine. The old man can go first. Thank you. You senior citizen, you. I need to start with the words I always start with. Oh, daddy O's. Haku Hank here. With this episode 199 haiku, here it goes. First TCSPs, a success. Rub my testes to Carano talk. Oh, daddy yo's. And if you guys don't know who Carano is, it's Gina Carano. Look her up. She'll fucking make you test your testes. <laughs> yeah. Bah. That was that was cute haiku, Hank. <laughs> Let's see if uh, maybe alliteration Al can can one up you, if you will. Oh, Greggy Jones! <laughs> alliteration Al here with this TCS episode two hundred, because we are in two hundredth episode here. Alliteration, here goes. <laughs> awesome accolades on an amped anniversary. Totally thrilled to take in 200. Be bodaciously badass bantering about balls. <laughs> May yes. you motherfuckers make many mo. <laughs> oh, Greggy Jones. Have a great alliterative episode 200. And I gotta get myself some more beers. 
That's fucking fantastic. That's not fair. He can use more words than me. <laughs> That's your problem. You you shoehold yourself into this haiku bullshit. I'm a Twitter phenomenon over here. You're followed by three people. I'm just a phenomenon. Oh. <laughs> The best there is, the best there was, and the best there will ever be. Where's what? my beer? <laughs> what, was, what was that very last part? <laughs> Baby beer. <laughs> my Greg impersonation. Oh, dear Lord. So that was our HHA standoff. Uh, I think we should have a crowd vote. For those of you that vote for HH, let's hear it. Oh, you man. sons of bitches! <laughs> and for those of you that vote for alliteration now, <laughs> I'm gonna take it all to Twitter for you guys. Fuck you! You're out! You're out of my Twitter feed! I'm blocking all of you! Yeah, you take that to Twitter, you bitch. <laughs> Just like a real man would. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna be pew pew in the peanut! <laughs> Just keeps Pow! getting worse. Just keeps getting worse. All right, can we have Mike back? We're done with HH. Uh, <sighs> how you feeling? Good. I'm Did you relaxed. miss all that? No, I'm relaxed. You, you feel good after that gay porn? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You, you centered? I'm centered. Is your chai centered? My, he looks yes. relaxed. Yeah, yeah, he he looks, chai. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Chai. That's chai, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I think we should take a break because uh, I need some beer. I tap on it as if the people listening, like as if it's not a bottle that see doesn't make any noise. <laughs> there. Oh, there it is! Oh, you figured it out. Fantastic! I everybody. like beer. Yes. Uh, let's take a little break. We'll get some beer. We'll come back. I uh, like beer. <laughs> Thank you, Rain Man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like beer. I like beer. I really like beer. <laughs> you see DFG over here. I like beer. Hell yeah! <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! This is the worst show ever. Let's that- get out of here. <laughs> I don't know what that What's was. That? <laughs> huh? The DFG. Oh, okay. Let's get out. Congratulations. Of here. Let's take a break. We're back, everybody. We'll be back with uh, more beer and uh, less mic. Thank you. Be back, bitches. And this is the compelling story of how Awkward Apocalypse began. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Greg. What you doing? I'm just drinking some wine. Want to, like, make a show and stuff? Okay. We can talk about awkward things and boobs. I like boobs. Me too. It's decided. And that is the compelling story of how the Awkward (laughs) Apocalypse began. Do check us out on Facebook. Facebook.com slash Awkward Apocalypse. At Awkward Pod on Twitter. And don't forget to call us 323-379-9225. The end. Hello, podcast fans. Adam Carolla here. I'm leading the fight against patent trolls who are threatening this medium. It's not about me. It's about the podcast you're listening to right now. If I go down, this show could be next. Visit fundanything.com forward slash patent troll for more information on how you can keep podcasting alive. Thank you and mahalo. Get your hands out of your pockets, boys. The charity strike is coming back. Oh my god, that's right. Welcome back in the Chase Strike, everybody. That's right. I got to hand out. It's going to cost me $17. <laughs> that noise you all heard. Uh, I'm Gregory Brown Jones, still sitting with me. Unfortunately, they're still here. Uh, Trigger Mike. And Midlife Prices. We're back, bitches. That's right. This is still episode 200. We're still alive. And this is still 200, right? Are you, are you hitting what? a bong or what? Thanks. Nice. I've been doing yoga lately, so they say breathe out for like 10 seconds. So I was doing that with my pew. <laughs> How'd that work for you? <laughs> yeah, I feel calm. Uh, I think it's time for the most important part of the I show. I do yogurt sometimes. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Oh, I like this part of the show. Uh, 
Undubiously. Indubiously? Indubiously. It's time for the chick of the day, everybody. Who likes chick of the day? Oh, yeah. Mike doesn't. Uh, anyways, chick mm. of the day. Her name is... It doesn't really matter what her name <laughs> is. <laughs> what? I don't think you added one. No, I did. It's right here. Her name is... Seal... Seal Seal Slutty... Sl- Slutty McDickson. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Seal J. Norendo. S-I-L-J-E. Oh, her, yeah. oh, damn. And then her last name, Norendo. N-O-R-E-N-D-A-L. No. She's a snowboarder. <laughs> oh. Oh, there it goes, Eva, finally. You. Yeah. <laughs> Can you say Coca-Cola now? No. Wow. No, she's still... She's still Say it like say. a Jew. Yeah. <laughs> That's racist. Well, I'm sorry. Uh, how, how I, dare I you. take it back. I take it back. Let, let's not I'm talk about. Racist. Let's not talk about Jews. We're talking about hot chicks here. Really. <laughs> That's way better than Jews. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, anyways, she's she's really hot. Check her out. Google her. Uh, she may have a few shots in a bikini. Oh wow. Not her real sport. Right? <laughs> no, she's a snowboarder. <laughs> she stepped out of bounds. But, uh, you just type in her name and then like hot and. Uh, Google knows what you mean. Yeah. <laughs> Google. In fact, you just type in her Wait. name and then the space. Google is already like, oh, hot. Hot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like the, uh, was like, it Tosh Point Oda does the, uh, what, for, oh, no, it was. Uh, great Jezelnik. story. Jezelnik used to do, what is Google going to say? And it would give like the top four things if you great type story. in a certain <laughs> thing. <laughs> I said black people are, and then, or black people like, and then number one was watermelon. Really? Yes. Young You're Google. racist. <laughs> it was Google. Right. How dare you? It was Google. What wow. was that? It was, oh, it was up there. Number, it was up that's there. racist. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> number number three was scissor. <laughs> there it is. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not white women. Fat white women. Get it right. Hey. Oh. What? what you got, You're not their boyfriend? type, Jenny. Don't be offended. You got, you got a black boyfriend or something? Uh-oh. <laughs> Breaking news, everybody. <laughs> Hit the music. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Oh, dear Lord. Let's let's talk about uh, something important. Wait, no. It's not important. <laughs> Did I just hear booze? Are, are we going back on the break? <laughs> hockey time, everybody. The big breaking news of hockey. Uh, well, it's Al- not on. <laughs> Alex Ovechkin has uh, done himself a favor. Oh, yeah? He no longer will have a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> the wedding has been called off. Oh, wow. Uh, the only problem is it's Maria Karolenko. She related to the basketball player? I don't know. Is her wingspan the same? What? Her what? wingspan. Is it the same? Yes, the, yes, they are related. Okay. Thank you. Sure, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking weirdo. How did she spell her last name? Huh? Never mind. I think, I think they're related. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah that's great. This show was taken. To who? <laughs> By the way, I... Is she related to who? The, the basketball player. Andre Karolinko. Andre, oh. Andre Karolinko. Oh. So For all We're you having a discussion amongst ourselves. <laughs> Fucking cock <talk chaos. laughs> That's because we're talking about hockey. <laughs> yeah, it's always boring when we talk about yeah. hockey. Uh, speaking of boring and talk about hockey, I'm going to call her up to the microphone situation <laughs> because... <laughs> I figure this is a perfect time because she cannot find a bottle opener. Hey, Mike has a bottle opener on his uh, penis. But will you do it since (laughs) it's the 49ers and you're a Cowboys fan? Yeah. It's at the bottom. But it's also a nail clipper. Yeah, you can cut your nails. It's a nail. He he uses that to trim his dick hairs. Mm -hmm. (laughs) Don't laugh. It works. Wow. Nicely done. I remember my first beer. <laughs> uh, thank you for picking up the Me microphone. Too. Yes, I picked it up. Yeah, I. You know, it's it's funny. I should have had you bring it over. It, it's. I wanted to oh. have you on the show. I Eva has always been that. a part of. Oh. <laughs> sorry. What? Huh? I just. I remember Don't first interrupt beer. him. He's talking about me. Oh, I, 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 I feel like I have the two old Muppet guys over here. <laughs> <laughs> you think they're funny? <laughs> uh. I crack myself up. At least somebody laughs. laughs. I wanted to have Eva on the show because she hasn't been on in a while. And uh, right before <laughs> she... Yeah. And she, she was big at timing us, right? It, it, it's been the best 20 episodes we've ever <laughs> had. <laughs> uh, 
ever. <laughs> I Brent, wish this was like a video podcast so they can see the look I'm giving you. Yeah, it's that look of you're totally right. Uh, <laughs> or about, that fuck you. I have really about, missed her insight on NBA. Yeah. yeah. About the time she uh, stopped showing up was about the time I had new intros made. We heard we heard the girls <laughs> saying like, "Oh, you know, hands are your pockets, boy." Blah blah blah. Well, I had one made for Eva that's never been played to the public yet. But I think it, it Wow It now needs to be played yeah. Here it is Ladies and gentlemen The TCS Network is proud to bring you The Charity Strike Ahora para los amigos y familiares de Eva Damas y caballeros La cadena TCS se enorgullece en presentar The Charity Strike Pero si le entiendes a esta parte, no vas a disfrutar el resto del show. No, here are a couple of badass dudes and a chick with big boobs. Riga Mike, Rebound, and Eva. <laughs> that is the best thing ever. You're right. That's why I had a Oh, made. my. Uh, it basically said, you know, they, they, uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the charity strike or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And said, and for those of you... Or if the friends and family of Eva that are listening... Uh, and you can actually understand and this. And you can actually understand that TCS presents to you the charity strike. And now uh, a chick with big boobs and... Or two dudes and a chick with big boobs that you know, Eva rebounded. Oh, like my God. That no, I came first. Do not... You always do. Do not discredit me. <laughs> Shocking. You know, let's call that my birthday present because our birthdays aren't that far apart. Right. And that, that, and that cost that was me actually... a fair amount of $5. Whoa. So. I will give you two fifty, <laughs> and we'll call that your birthday present. <laughs> done and done, everybody. Yeah, nice. nice. two fifty richer. That's what I get for... Uh, never mind. Uh, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so, uh, you know, Eva, thank you for joining us. Thank you for not showing up anymore. It's made the show... <laughs> Infinitely better. Well, uh, you never call me anymore. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> wow! I just thought I wasn't being invited. Wow, this is awkward. This is yeah, <laughs> super awkward. Should we, should we tell them? <laughs> let's, let's play, should 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 we just play tell some. Them? You want to talk about awkward apocalypse some, some more? Yeah. We're <laughs> <laughs> gonna play some breaking music. Breaking the ice. Yeah. Breaking the ice. Tim, wait, Tim Tebow's fire doesn't break the ice. <laughs> Shit. No, it's because uh, it, I like the other Tim Tebow song. Play it. The other one. <laughs> well, you'll play it later, right? We do have a story later, Come on. right? Right. Yes. Okay, we'll play, play it later. All right. We'll play. Sounds it good to me. Don't don't fucking spoil it. Sorry. This is why you haven't been back on. <laughs> <laughs> well, when I heard alliteration, Al was going to be on. I was like, well, I have to show up. Yeah. Mm. That's why I totally up. have to yeah. show up. Yeah, that's why everybody showed up. Yes. It's, it's quite true. Um, all right. Thank you for joining us, Eva. Thank you for being a part of the show at some point in time. Uh, <laughs> well, if you call me, I will come back. I don't call anybody. I don't even call my own girlfriend. I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> he tells her to hang up the phone. He's like, shut right. up. Wait till I get home. Why did you call me? <laughs> <laughs> Baby, I just, I can't wait till tonight when you get here and we're going to like get naked. Like, why did you fucking call me? <laughs> yeah, that's usually how it goes down. No. Yep. <laughs> I have a two-hour drive, and you're calling right. me with that news. Right. That, that's all you had to say? <laughs> you could have checked that to me. Right. <laughs> I'm getting dirty looks now. Uh, <laughs> so anyways, thank you. thank you for joining Baby us. Baby burp. Any, any hockey news you want to share with us? No. I. <laughs> okay, great. And that's why she hasn't been back on, people. Thank you. Have a good night, Emma. <laughs> she has nothing to share because she's a San Jose fan. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Over the wire. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> it's turned it up. He'll turn it up. Oh. Oh yeah. I didn't even have to say hit my music. You just knew. Well, I just figured she's talking. So <laughs> it's a good time to hit my music. Uh, UFC <laughs> Ultimate Fight Night was this past weekend. It was number forty-six in that count. Uh, I don't know why they keep count, but they do. Uh, Conor McGregor was in his hometown of Ireland. All right, let's move on to football, everybody. He got a win, <laughs> and uh, Diego Brandao went down with a knockout. That anyways. was tonight's fight? No, this was last week. Oh. This is just a recap midlife. Didn't you watch it? It was free. Last week? Yeah. No, I didn't know about it until after oh. the weekend. Oh, actually, this Asshole. one was on the phone, so you probably didn't watch it. Oh, no. Oh. I don't watch phones. Yeah, so that's the only thing to mention on UFN 46 is that... I did uh, DVR the one tonight, though. There you go. You, uh, I'll get to that. 
Oh, sorry. Do not spoil it like Eva. Oops. Thank you. Whoa, Eva's burping. <laughs> she must be mad. It's like it, it's like oh, wow. her off. Oh, God. She's making room to get drunker so she can kill Greg later. That's what she's doing. <laughs> it wouldn't be the first attempt. <laughs> well, last week was the TCSPs, right? On the same night as the SPs. Well, the SPs... Uh, we had Chael Sonnen as the first MMA fighter to win an SP. A TCSP. Yeah, TCSP. Sorry. Thank you. Uh, Ronda Rousey was the first athlete in the mixed martial arts realm to win an SP. She's a female. We don't do that here. We don't give women the credit they need. Uh, so Ronda uh, Rousey wins an SP for best female athlete. She definitely deserves it because they all suck other than her. Oh, and cool. she's, so. she's a little easy on the eyes. <laughs> little. Yeah. Little. But I'm gay, so I don't know. <laughs> That's true. I don't know about that stuff. Yeah, how's that gay porn working out for you? <laughs> it's working out pretty well. That it's working. Two dicks. Like, you, no, like I didn't Jenny know guys could it. do that. <laughs> of course they can. It must be double jointed or something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, last right. week I gave you news story. on Gina Carina. Uh, Gina Carano, sorry. He's so gay, he can't even say a chick's name right. <laughs> Gina right. Carona? I'm like, who cares about this chick? Uh, anyways, I give you news that she probably wouldn't be signing because uh, her looks are too good and she might get hurt, so they wouldn't be able to sign her to movies. Well, apparently, Dana White said that he'll have her signed by next week, which is probably supposed to be this week. Is she going to be naked or not? <laughs> <laughs> if uh, the wardrobe malfunctions. Next story. Yes. <laughs> uh, so Gina Carano might be signed by Dana White. He said he's going to sign her. So let's, I don't know. She's not good enough to beat Ronda Rousey. So it won't matter anyways. Uh, moving on. Mike Tyson. Infamously, he uh, bit the ear off of. Evander Holyfield, 1997. What? When did it was that happen? It's very sexy. It was just a. It was like a Fifty Shades of <laughs> yeah, Grey. Breaking news, everybody! <laughs> breaking news. Fifty Shades of Grey gone wrong. Mike Tyson was trying to lovingly nibble on the ear of Evander Holyfield, bit it off on accident, and uh, apparently things have been reconciled. Seventeen years later, oh, and oh, finally, Mike Tyson will induct Evander Holyfield into the Nevada Hall of Fame. And they're buddies now, and they'll you be know, joining me in the bedroom later. You know what this Whoa. sounds like? This is a lot like the HBK Bret Hart rivalry. For those of you wrestling fans out here, there's no bigger real life rivalry than Shawn Michaels and Bret Hart. Yeah, wrestling is not fake, people. Wrestling is not fake! <laughs> this sounds a lot like that. You know, Shawn Michaels really had to apologize to Bret Hart to get him to like him again. And, and so this is probably a lot like that, right? Yeah, he admitted he lied in his book. And Bret Hart was right. sour about it for yeah. a long time. I Tyson mean, didn't bite Hollyfield. Hollyfield bit Hollyfield. <laughs> wow. <laughs> really? Well, that's takes some, finally, Thanks, someone, <laughs> finally someone bit their own ear after years of this. <laughs> are, are you saying that uh, Tyson thinks he's cute, but he knows he's sexy? <laughs> Chirp 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 chirp, 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 chirp. All right. They're all talking to each other. It's a wrestling now. joke, people. people. It's a wrestling joke. People love you all know about wrestling. so much right now. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a wrestling joke. <laughs> uh, but yes, Bret Hart finally forgave Shawn Michaels, decided that... Just he, talk about MMA. No yeah. one likes the wrestling, apparently. <laughs> I fucked that one up. Uh, you did. I apparently, did. people in Scotland want to join us for wrestling, though. So They do. We'll, yeah, we'll talk we'll get that on the next show. Uh, anyways, tonight, I have sacrificed a lot for you on your birthday and the 200th episode. I doubt it. <laughs> Of course, you paid me well to be here tonight, so thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome for that. But, uh, UFC job. on Fox 12 is going on tonight. It is one of my favorite fights of the night, or fights of the year, I should say. Robbie Lawler w- is fighting Matt Brown tonight. I think it's already <laughs> happened. I'm trying not to look at the scorecards right now to see what happened. Oh, yeah, I can't look. I don't want to spoil this. I'm uh, he, fights, he fought Matt Brown tonight uh, for the number one contendership in the light or the welterweight division. Anthony Johnson make his second fight at, welt- at light heavyweight, and he fought Antonio Rogerio Noguera. So we'll see what happened there if you guys actually watch it. And now I'll strip for you by Sean Michaels. I've got the look that drives a ghost wild. I've got the mood. My favorite part of this whole thing was the people in the crowd going, what song is this? Yeah. <laughs> and then the other saying, delayed. Wait, 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 what song is this? <laughs> it's the heartbreak kid, it's people. Michaels. Oh. I've got a life, too. That's why I watch wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> it's the light of his life. <laughs> and that well, is the fighting news. <laughs> Albert digging deep there with the Where's Your Smile reference. That was good. That was good. <laughs> I caught it. He lost it in the club. Uh, you guys, if, if, you've, if you've been one of the few uh, individuals... Wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're losing fans by the how drunk I am. <laughs> we are too funny. I, for I said individuals. They just left. You're welcome. <laughs> Good night, everybody. 
Uh, if you've been one of the few individuals that stuck with us throughout the shows, you know that uh, we've, we've had various guest hosts when people like Trigger Mike and Midlife have been too busy with things called jobs to, uh, you know, show up. <laughs> Assholes. Uh, and and uh, we have in the crowd tonight, we have, we have Daniel. Hey. Hey, what's going on, guys? What's happening? Hey, all right. Oh! All right. The Why are you guys plotting this, man? You need to vote for me. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm a swell guy. Haiku Hank is like still me. mad. He's a, he's he's a swell bitter. guy. Yeah. He's a swell guy. You know, it's always good for Haiku Hank's haiku is when he's mad, though. Yeah. Did Haiku just, like, run out and then, like, take your microphone and put it back? <laughs> he came all the way back just yeah. to say that. Get that guy back out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Security? Yeah. Uh, anyways, Daniel, uh, he's only been allowed on the show basically because he's a Lakers fan. Right. Uh, not because of his football affiliation. affiliation. I. That's hard to say when you're drunk. <laughs> <laughs> that was much better than the Coca-Cola Raiders for life or Raiders what uh, sorry oh, man. I'll kick him off I, I don't think his mic is working off. <laughs> oh Lakers 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 yeah Lakers go Lakers there it is okay yeah, go Lakers, Lakers. Yeah, yeah, Lakers. Kick just kick him off yeah. what's happening buddy yeah what's going on man yeah, I, I, happy birthday happy birthday oh well thank you thank you might actually be my birthday uh, mm-hmm. how uh, how do you feel about the big three coming into LA <laughs> I'm um uh, Depressed. Yeah, sounds about right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, it, it's it's no good, man. I mean, they're just they're just going downhill, and then they finally got Byron Scott. It's like just right. in time for summer league to end. We broke it here live on the yeah. show, everybody. Yeah. <laughs> I'm waving to the people behind me that don't exist. Yeah. <laughs> it's like two months too late. Why didn't they get the coach already? What, what's going on? Well, because you know, think about it. We we almost had a chance at LeBron James <laughs> yeah, <I think. laughs> and Carmelo Anthony, right? Yeah, we. <laughs> Big shot. Both of them. Both yeah. of them. We could have landed both of them. Could have got them both. Carmelo. Yeah. That could have been the big three. Yeah. <laughs> and, and while we're at it, Chris Bosch. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah we had Bosch. a chance at him. And uh, what's that guy's name? Dwayne Wade. He's Wade. about as good Dwayne as Steve Wade. Nash these yeah, days. Dwayne Wade. Yeah. 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 We, were, we were almost contenders. Yeah. And Phoenix, Phoenix was always in it too. You know, they were just in what? you know LeBron James. Like that's right. They Phoenix had the money for LeBron. Oh yeah, but yeah. they didn't have the city. Here, for here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna turn down Mike's microphone. Right <laughs> <here>. <laughs> <laughs> and what I'm gonna tell you is, I actually thought LeBron. Well, while, while it's turned down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought LeBron should have gone to Phoenix. Really? I like here, <laughs> we love you, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and the reason is because first of all they have all the money in the world because they don't have any talent on that team. That's true. True. That's true. Yeah. But I mean for as far as they got last season, like no mm-hmm. one expected the Phoenix Suns to almost make the playoffs. Right. Cuz the Phoenix Suns. I mean it's Phoenix. We right. Want. Exactly. Okay. Now, LeBron could go there with a fair amount of talent surrounding him and all the money in the world he could you, ever want. You know what, though? Like, I had this idea when we're talking about their trainers and how good they Don't are. Don't you say like, it! Uh-oh. No, no, no. Hey! You know, they, they, they make everybody healthy, right? You know, like, they should just That's what go, Mike says. Yeah, well, they should get Derrick Rose. They should get Andrew Bynum. And just, <laughs> like, I mean, yeah, seriously, get them to health. And these the guys. Next big cactus, Andrew Bynum! <laughs> That's what I'm saying right there, man. It's like a zombie apocalypse it, team. it would be. It would yeah. be amazing. A bunch of dead people walking around that court. Hey, they'd get them to play, and they play like all stars. And why don't, why don't they get Odom while they're at or yeah. Odin? Well, while they're, while they're yeah, at Greg it, Odin, yeah, Greg Odin, yeah, Greg yeah, Odin, Bynum, I'm saying Steve Nash, yeah, yeah Steve Nash. Nash. You, guys, yeah. you guys underestimating hey. the Phoenix Suns training staff? Huh? Call, call them the Walking Not Dead. Not at all. Hmm? Walking Dead. Walking <laughs> dead. <laughs> the Phoenix Walking. I like. Them. Well, you know what. One more reason why they should have gotten LeBron. They could have had at least one player in the Hall of Fame. Yeah. Hey, Finally. hey, you oh. son of a bitch. Could have adjusted Hall of Fame. <laughs> Charles Barkley. <laughs> That's right. 76ers? Yeah, Charles sorry. Barkley. I had to represent for that. I mean, Charles <laughs> Barkley went further with the Suns. Yeah, he's the half, Sixers, Philly, you yeah, yeah, half Philly, half Phoenix. Uh, more most, Phoenix than Philly. He uh, wanted out of Philly. I'd say more Philly than Phoenix. Yeah, probably more Don't Philly. Yeah. yeah, It was I'll fat, see. Charles. How's, how's <laughs> Kevin Johnson doing that? Hall of Hall Fame? Hall of Fame? Oh, he, he was this close this year. Guys. Oh. Had, Next had, year is his year. He had that dunk on Hakeem Olajuwon. He did. He yeah. motherfucking dunked on hockey. That's a top ten dunk of all <laughs> that time. That was. It yeah. was beautiful. Midlife has even conceded that KJ may be a Hall of Famer. So I don't have? even start on Wait, me, what? rebound. What? No, he hasn't. Don't make me cut a re. What? what? I was going to say cut a promo on you. It's a <laughs> rebound. Someone's had too much beer. Kevin Johnson. Uh, nope. Well, you act like you don't know Kevin Johnson. Oh no, no, I know the number. Okay. I know number seven. He's, okay, thank you. Uh-huh. He's See, number number the fans seven. No, number seven mayor in the county of where <laughs> Sacramento is. <laughs> it's not much to do there. 
Yeah. No, there's not. Yeah. It's Sacramento. Hey, he it, saved the Kings. He saved the Kings is right. Yes. Wait, hold on. Did he really save the Kings? <laughs> he screwed Sacramento, or, but he saved the Kings. Right, they're really? still in Sacramento. Yeah. <laughs> and he fucked Seattle, too. Yeah, I was about to say, meanwhile, Seattle's still dead. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think Kevin Johnson did that much good. He's a bastard. Anyways, Daniel, thank you for thank showing you. up, my yeah, friend. Yeah, thanks for having me. And, Appreciate uh, we, it. We're going to talk about football. If we talk about something not Raiders related, they have something good to say, you know, you can, oh, chime you can pipe up. But, All uh, the ladies are looking at gay porn right now. Look at they that. are. Look at this. <laughs> Spreading like a disease. Watch yeah. about jerking off. Yeah. Oh, Jenny O is jerking <laughs> off right now. That's awesome. Let's let's talk about. Uh, I don't know. Should we talk about some sacks? <laughs> yes, yes. We all love sacks. Ah, it's football nomenclature for when a quarterback is tackled behind the line of scrimmage. <laughs> we gotta stop picking up empty beers. Ah, oh, football news, everybody. Who's excited for football? All right, let's do it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, first of all, the 49ers have officially opened Levi Stadium. Yeah. Yes, it's beautiful. Look it up. Yeah. Google it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Unfortunately, they're opening it with the soccer game. Oh, but let's move yeah. on quickly. Oh, man. Yes, very quickly. Uh, so anyways, uh, Ray Rice suspended two games Ooh. for beating the fuck out of his wife. <laughs> and two on a lighter note. Uh, who yep. knows how long Josh Gordon is out for smoking weed, guys? Right. Who knows how long? <laughs> who knows? How dare you smoke weed? He's going to be having yes. a meeting with hey, uh, You want to beat a hoe. That's okay. He might be out of football forever for smoking weed, but Ray Rice, two games for beating his wife. Yeah, in fact, Stephen A. Smith might get fired for Ray Rice beating his wife. Oh, really? Did you guys hear about this? No, what happened? Did you guys hear about the Stephen A. Smith thing? Okay, that's no. Uh, <laughs> so see Any of you out there hear the show? Yeah, okay. Mr. Participant over here, <laughs> all you could go home. Thank you, Albert. Uh, Stephen A. Smith, Mr. I think LeBron is going to <laughs> Miami. That guy. He was right. Yeah, he was right. He was right. You know what's really unfortunate about Stephen A. Smith? He's always fucking right, but he's so fucking annoying. He's so loud doing it. Yeah, he's, he really is. LeBron James is going to Miami. <laughs> Sources tell me. Yes, yeah, sources. I can't tell you who they are because I'm blowing them as we speak. When did he become Christopher Walken? <laughs> <laughs> but my sources got to have more cowbell. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> he oh. called me Christopher Walken. No. Fuck off. Oh, wow. That's a trigger. Anyway, Stephen right A. There. Smith talking about this Ray Rice situation uh, says he should have been suspended for more games than he is. The, the two games he suspended. Uh, but... In the process of which, he was saying that bitches need to stop provoking their male friends. There it is. Thank you. Holy shit. Thank you. Yeah, right? (laughs) Yes. Like, uh, you can think it, but you cannot say it out loud. If if you sluts (laughs) (laughs) would stop provoking the very strong uh, athletic football playing black males that you're dating and or married to, uh, they wouldn't beat you. Yeah. (laughs) Duh. So shut up. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and know your role. Zions. Uh, Zions. Yeah, Zions. Y- UFC reference. Uh, yeah. That's uh, that's basically what he said. He, he was saying that uh, what Ray Rice is totally – what he do is totally wrong. But what the females need to recognize is that – that's a really good Stephen A. Smith impression. What are you doing? Why are you laughing? I just got an alert that Jenny Ovadia changed her profile picture on my Facebook for some reason. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I'm glad we're paying attention to the show. Kind of weird. Uh, <laughs> what? I'm sorry. Did you say you're super excited? Bored. Oh. Excited. Okay, good. Bored. Excited. Uh, yeah. It's called planking. We're talking about football. Be excited. Anyways, he said that uh, as much as Ray Rice shouldn't have done what he did, she shouldn't have provoked him. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, he'll probably lose his job. Bitches be hoes. Right. Uh, Justin Blackman, speaking of suspension, he's uh, already suspended indefinitely because he's smoking so much weed. Well, he got pulled over yeah, and arrested Josh again. Gordon treatment right there. Right. He got a pulled over and arrested again for smoking more weed. <laughs> What's with wide receivers and smoking weed? This is the third time he's been caught. Yeah. And he's caught while he's suspended. Yeah. He's, he's done with football, guys. Smoking weed is bad. Yeah. That's bad. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's hashtag smart. Uh, Justin. Browns fans, or fan, excuse me, one fan, has, this is so good, has urinated on the grave of Art Modell. <laughs> Okay, for those of you who don't know who Art Modell is, he used to be the Cleveland Browns football team owner, 
Move the team to Baltimore and stop yawning. Uh, name them something else. <laughs> Where they won the Super Bowl four years later after Cleveland had been waiting forever to win a Super Bowl. Right. They moved, then won the Super Bowl. And he, he basically did it in the middle of the night. Like, nobody knew this was happening. This is very much like super secret stuff. And, uh, and all Cleveland fans hate him. And so this fan <laughs> went to his grave in Baltimore and pissed on his grave. <laughs> Wow. Literally pissed. And the funny part about this wasn't like some like really manly stance of I'm gonna whip my cock out and fucking piss all over your grave. He had a he had a catheter. You guys didn't hear that. Uh, the crowd say that's Cleveland for you, and yes, it is. Uh, he 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 basically pissed down his leg <laughs> onto the grave oh of Art Modell's. Yes, that's very. And then as soon as he got done with that, he, he went and tried to pull his LeBron jersey out of the fire. <laughs> it's uh, it's it's a shame. So, but yes, yeah, so th- so thank you, Cleveland fans. Fans, I can't talk. I'm drunk for being super classy. Uh, speaking of Cleveland fans, Johnny Football has signed a deal with Snickers. Mm. You must have been hungry. Yeah. Yep. Need a break? Mm-hmm. Oh, wait, that's... Huh? What? Hangry. Hangry? <laughs> hangry. Is that something that Hank gets when he's... I'm <laughs> back. Oh, I thought that was like oh, okay. Hank gets hungry and angry because he's stoned. She definitely knows the sticker campaign better than us. <laughs> At least somebody does. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Anything else interesting going on? Alden Smith? Yes! Alden Smith! Alden Smith! Say yes! Hey, anybody 49ers 49, fans out here? 49 ers yeah. What? All right, everyone's 49ers fans. Wow, every single one of them. That's weird. Did you hear all that? <laughs> Who yeah. knew? This is Southern California. We wow. got all Niners yeah. fans. Every in the single crowd. one of them. Thank you very much. Al- Alden Smith, uh, he's very getting loyal. <laughs> it's true. 11 days on the work crew and three years probation for his DUI slash weapons charge. <laughs> yeah. Why Ray Rice, it? suck it. Yeah, why weapons charge? Because someone got stabbed at a party. That's right. Yeah. Because it wasn't my weapon. And then he also, they found out he had guns they had purchased legally in Arizona, but, but as they, as Santa you all know, Francisco. Arizona, you can do whatever the fuck you want, and they brought him back to California, and that's not legal, because it's California. Uh, the Broncos owner, this is a super happy story, Pat Bolin is giving up control of the team because he has Alzheimer's. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <Good. laughs> Go, Go Pat! Woo, Pat, you're the man! It's, Woo! it's not all bad, guys. <laughs> 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 Yeah, this, this is. Uh, it's not all bad. He won't remember the Super Bowl last year. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, someone watches Hollywood Babylon over here. <laughs> oh, that was pretty fantastic. <laughs> hey, trick a mic, everybody. Good night. Yes, I made my funny. <laughs> That's why they're all here for the one, the one funny. <laughs> that- Mm-hmm. <laughs> wow. Guys, you're embarrassing me? <laughs> that guy has a really high voice. <laughs> I pay well. I pay well. Apparently. <laughs> that guy, not so high. I needed that <laughs> for the yin and the yang. I need a high pitch voice and a low pitch voice. Thank you very much. How much does that cost in you? In the, yeah, they're pretty Japanese. It's okay. They don't, they don't know the translation of American dollars. It's okay. Uh, what are they? They're Japanese. <laughs> See? See, he forgot his accent for a second. He brought it back. Godzilla. He knew I wanted an American accent earlier, and now he's just showing you his real authenticity. Oh, now he's just killing mm-hmm. it. He, he really, really is. Um, let's see. Let's, let's skip down a couple of stories. Tony Dungy. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> is in hot well, water. Boss? He's in hot water. Like a hot dog. Yeah, right. For saying that he would not have taken Michael Sam uh, in the draft. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Michael Sam is the first openly gay player to come to the NFL. Mm-hmm. Tony Dungy says he would not take him because, not because he's a good or bad player, but because he would not want the media circus that comes with bringing in the first openly gay player. I, I kind of don't blame him. What a bitch move, though. Well, he's not saying he's a good or bad player, and this is how most football coaches think. They think like, okay, well, th- nobody will hire Tim Tim Tebow because he has a media circus. Yeah. If you're, and I think Tim Tebow and Michael Sam are kind of on that same level. No. Uh, no? Yes. What? <laughs> I, I, for, Tim Tebow's an athlete. God damn it! He just won't switch positions. Oh, uh, here we go. This one's for Tebow. 
Yeah. yeah. Let's go. All he do is win, 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 no matter what. what? Got Jesus on his mind, he could never get enough. No. And every time he step up in the building, everybody rush out to go up. Go up, go up. And they stay there. Ooh. And they stay there. Uh, Tebow is at least as good a player as Michael Sam. In fact, there are many quarterbacks in the NFL right now that should, like, backups that should not be there, where Tim Tebow could very easily take that place. Are we talking Francisco and Blaine Gabbert? No, I'm not. Are are we talking about Tim Tebow, who took a team that was sucking, turned them around, took them to the playoffs, won a couple playoff games? Is that the the Tim Tebow? That Tim Tebow, yeah. And nobody likes him? Why? Apparently he loves God. Oh, that's right. No one loves that. <laughs> but I feel like... Oh, Eva's here, everybody. Oh, wait, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I, actually, I didn't I know she was here. I actually up, and I can say Coca-Cola. <laughs> oh! Wow. Yay! Ooh. I'm not slurring. Take that water away from me. <laughs> <laughs> actually, it was that apple cider stuff. Anyways. Back to football. Uh, back to football. Uh, I feel like if Michael Sam actually gets a shot in the professional leagues, he may play differently. Like... Is that nobody a game know- joke? No, oh, wow. no, 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 no. They all take shots. No, the- nobody knows how he's going to actually play in a professional league. You don't take that into account. I mean, yeah, it's you played in college. You played really well in college. It's the NFL. It's a little different. Well, here's the thing. Football coaches do not like media circuses. Yes. Uh, Belichick. Let's let's talk about Bill Belichick. How much would he hate having someone like Tim Tebow or Michael Sam on his team? Well, he cut Tim Tebow, so he, we can exactly. He would hate that so exactly. much. And it's not that he's like, oh, you're gay, you can't play football. Yeah. It's you decided to hold a press conference about this, so now there's going to be a media circus following you. Not that there should be, yeah. but there is. And because of that, you're not on my team. Yeah, you know, you know, football what coaches think. hate that shit. You, you know what I think? Like, you know, like that's Tony Dungy's like. Main There's reason is because right. Mike's yeah, to go around. Yeah, right. he, he's a he's a distraction. Number one, you know what I mean. So I feel like like Johnny Football. He's just come out and say he's gay, so everyone will leave him alone. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> it really helps. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Damn it, Daniel! I think I forgot my point. Oh, that's uh, fine. You're you're a <laughs> Cowboys <laughs> fan. Drop you, the mic. You did you did make a good point. However, I still. Uh, but Bill Belichick had Team Tebow in the first place. Right, like, he, he cut picked him. him, but he, he wanted him. him to be but a then tight he cut end, him, so he changed his mind. No, no, no. He cut he him because of the position circus. And he wouldn't switch positions. And he wouldn't switch positions. If he went to tight end and took Aaron Hernandez's place, very fitting her replacement, right? right. Although that's they both so. are getting it in prison at the point. I've right? completely agreed with that point. I always have thought Tim Tebow should have been a tight end instead of a quarterback. That's right. Because that's that's what. But anyways, if they were going to keep him as a quarterback, I mean, he picked him in the first place. Like you know, he had him he on brought the team. Him in. He hired him in. He brought him in. Whatever. But. Michael Sam, it's a little different, you know. It's like give him a shot. Maybe he'll he play was even SEC better. Defensive Player of the Year, co-defensive. Well, player here's of the thing: it, it's not that Michael Sam is a good or bad player, and no one, it's especially the locker. And they keep saying, they keep making this point: is no one in the locker room cares that he's gay or not gay, or whatever. That's not the problem. It's the problem is the media is following him because he's gay. Because he's the first one to say I'm gay, just like uh, Jason Collins in the NBA. He's the first one to do it. The media is like, can we fucking hang off your back? Please? But then again, Literally what Jeff Fisher what Jeff Fisher has done in St. Louis, he, he talked to Michael Sam. He told him, let's not do this biography on the Oprah Network right now. He said, and he, and he stopped it. <laughs> he stopped doing the Oprah show. And uh, we haven't really heard much of Michael Sam. If he, we had, he'd be on the show right that's, now. And that's the smartest thing you can do. So Jeff Fisher may be the best coach in football. Because yeah, the smartest thing you right do right is just, just show up and play. Yeah. It's a mustache. I, here's the thing. I think there are many more gay players in the NFL. In, in fact, in all Definitely. professional sports that are... that have, All quarterbacks, yeah. obviously. <laughs> they're behind him. Five asses at once. <laughs> have you seen Peyton Manning's ass? <laughs> He's clearly yes, gay. Yes, I have. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no one is worse than Tony Romo. Um, no. Hashtag ooh, truth. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> no, I think there are, are plenty of gay people in professional sports, but not a lot of them have come out. In fact, none of them have come out except for these two players, Jason Collins and Michael Sam. And the problem is not that they're gay. The problem is that the media yes. jumps all over this shit yes, yes. and is like, we need to cover you because you're gay. It's like, no, no, yeah, you don't. Yes. Just let them play football and, or basketball or whatever. Can you, can you imagine the backlash, too, if the Rams cut him? 
You know what I mean? And, and be based on his like soul, yeah. like how he plays. If right. they say you can't play, we're gonna cut you. And then everyone says, "Oh, you just cut him because he's gay." It's like, you no, we I mean? we yeah. cut him because he's not a good player. It's well, like, no, it's because he's gay. I can understand well, the, that. The I can understand ar- the not wanting to have to cut him. Yeah. The same argument can be made for Tim Tebow. He, they cut him because he's too religious. Yeah, and that's all he's known about. You know, he's a virgin. Oh, he's fucking religious. <laughs> same argument can be made. Stop there, talking about Jesus. There is you. one <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> There is one team that could have drafted Michael Sam and not had to draft and not have to cut him. It's not the Forty Niners, and that's the Dallas Cowboys because they got no one on defense any longer. That's fine. They are Talk horrible there, the and Michael Sam would improve that defense. I'm just saying that who cares if you're gay or, or straight in any professional sport? But I understand that, especially football coaches, they're the worst. Football coaches have zero patience. I love how soft your voice got for this little uh, spiel. Right <laughs> I feel like we should sing "We Are the World." Hold on, hold on a second. <laughs> The music. Let's get, let's I'm get about to fall on Daniel because uh, <laughs> we're fighting over the mic. He's getting real, guys. He's real uh, right now. I just, I just want to say, <laughs> 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 this is this is Jerry's final thought. Uh, it doesn't really matter which way you go. <laughs> the problem is the media cares oh, which so way you sexy. go so because uh, the media is fucked up. <laughs> let's just play football, everybody. And Michael Sam, remember, you're good enough, oh, you're smart Greg's enough, and doggone sounds people so like sexy. you. Let's right. be good to yourself and others. Yeah. Thank you. Thank yes. you, everybody. Thought for f- food for thought right there. Yeah. yeah. Thought for food. <laughs> thought for food. I thought about food. Food for thought. <laughs> Coca-Cola, everybody. Food, Coca-Cola. Uh, I wish everyone knew why we kept saying Coca-Cola. It's because you're drunk and you can't say it. <laughs> yes, that is exactly All right, right. good night, everybody. <laughs> Except I can say it now. Coca-Cola. <laughs> Woo! Woo! All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn that mic down because you keep touching it. <laughs> 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 I'm joking. I'm joking. Oh man, She's too drunk for jokes, dude. It's so <laughs> don't worry. Jokes. We're, let's let's talk a little uh, little justice. A little. All right, Hernandez justice. It's Hernandez My beer has been dry for minutes. Uh, Hernandez, his trail, as I wrote, or his trial, <laughs> uh, is going to start in January fifteenth or, or in January of two thousand fifteen. Uh, that's the the most recent of murders. He's got plenty of murders. <laughs> <laughs> the most Don't worry, recent, guys, he's got others. Right, the most recent murders with Odin Lloyd Smith. We'll start in January of 2015. That's Odin Smith. Check your scorecards. Odin <laughs> right, Smith. <yeah>. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was the other four. No, no, no. Odin Smith. Yeah, yeah. Getting it mixed up, Greg. <laughs> Shit, my bad, guys. Too many. Uh, that'll start in 2015. Oh, my God. Wow. Thank you, sir. Super fan of TCS. Man, now. what a nice bitch. <laughs> Number one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. Number one super fan <laughs> of AA. Now turn TCS because there's no AA. <laughs> Albert, a.k.a. Larry Chanel. He knows what's up. He knows the beer situation. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, that's really all the Hernandez news I got. So uh, it's that's enough. Hernandez Justice. It's Hernandez Justice. Anyways, um, finally to for the ladies. Here's a story what? for you, right? <laughs> yeah, hey ladies, hey. Summer's Eve. What? <laughs> <laughs> it uh, works miracles. I have <laughs> just started douching. <laughs> <laughs> My taint has never smelled no. better. <laughs> That's so hot. <laughs> so You're welcome. hot. You are. Welcome. Did you just like blow it in their general direction? <laughs> Oh, is that that odor? <laughs> Summer's Eve, that's right. <laughs> Smells like roses. <laughs> <laughs> the Big 12. I the like. Big 12, everybody. College football. Does anybody watch college football? <laughs> a little bit. Oh, that's I agree. a loud one fan. I only watch pro as well. <laughs> uh, the Big 12 has named Catherine Conti. Catherine who? Conti? Conti? Conti. 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 Catherine Conti. As Very the fitting. <laughs> what a cunt. <laughs> yeah. Apparently, uh, as the first female ref for the Big Twelve, 
Why? I tried to, here's the thing. I tried to find nude pictures of her on Google. <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend's out there, so no, I didn't. <laughs> did you try Bing? But, Oops. But yes, I did. <laughs> Bing is for losers. Yeah. If you want to watch porn. porn. Did you try to look for Bing videos? Bing is for people who want no No results. one jerks off to Bing, first of all. <laughs> I'm trying to <laughs> offer other suggestions, like you porn. I just... I, you could look for video. I just go to Porn MD. Is there where I go. you go. On, on the advice of hot Jenny RVG, Hot Body. Uh, are we getting an RVD chant that's Porn MD instead? Right. <laughs> Whole fucking show. Uh, Porn MD. Porn MD. Porn MD. Porn MD. First and only chant we'll ever have. I hope your neighbors. Good night, everybody. Chance. I hope your your neighbors love that chant. <laughs> I feel like I hear cops pulling up. Uh, yes. Anyway, so Catherine Cunty, the first female rep for the Big 12. Uh, whatever you're thinking, if you're thinking like, oh, Greg, I know I'm at your barbecue, but I can really use a jerk-off sesh right now. I'm going to go to your bathroom and Google her. Don't. <laughs> She's not She's easy. Not the on one the for ice. you. No. Well, this good news I like to masturbate to guys, not girls. Did I say... Hey, my name is Eva. Uh, I really want to go jerk off in the bathroom right now. <laughs> <laughs> Who do I need to look up? I made the seat warm for you. It's okay. <laughs> no, no. If Eva, if you're smart, you look up CJ Naredo. <laughs> <laughs> if I could spell it first, that would be awesome. I, I got it written down right here. I'll, nice. Uh, copy and paste it. Yeah, I'll copy and paste and whatever. It Send me a uh, link because I don't understand what you said. Neither do I. <laughs> yeah, Coca Cola. Coca Cola? What are you drinking? Are you drinking Coca Cola? No, I'm drinking that hard apple cider. What's that one soda you drink that's red with white writing? What? Coca Cola? <laughs> 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 Good night, everybody! Oh, I okay, she... I might be a little buzzed because I thought the soda was actually red and I was like, Rojo? You might be. You might be. You there is, probably, there is a soda are. in Nicaragua that is actually red. What? No joke. It's red. Oh. <laughs> 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 I hate you. It's back on. Hey, it's, back it's in on. between our birthdays. My birthday too. Great story. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, go on with your fucking story. I don't want to talk to you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> fucking jerk off. Oh, I cracked myself up. At least somebody laughs. Oh, Jenny O's got the mic. You guys are hilarious. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. At least somebody thinks so. There's our, there's our <laughs> one. You for me all you want. <laughs> Sorry, I have to. <laughs> Finally. Great the story. problem is, really, it's not you, Eva. It's that you talked about Nicaragua. We got a really problem it's, with Nicaragua It's right not now. you, Eva. TCS Nicaragua's <laughs> problem. We, we hit oh. Nickers. <laughs> Nickers. <laughs> oh, wow. wow. I think we should end the show. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, uh, that's good timing. I'll hit, I'll hit the music, and uh, we'll get out of here. Thank you guys for joining episode 200. <laughs> is Nick not? Okay. Uh, you can check us out at thecharitystrike.com, facebook.com slash charitystrike, at the charity strike, no E at the end of the old twat box, because we, we, we may have been Thank drunk. You, and uh, been on E like ever <laughs> and dropped it. Uh, what else we have? 805 409 3679. We're sorry to Phil from grumpunch.com. This did not work out with his schedule and uh, he couldn't make it on tonight's show. I don't blame him. He probably has anything else to do in the world. <laughs> Smart man. On that note, good night, everybody. <laughs> Later, bitches. <laughs> no knickers allowed. <laughs> <laughs> oh,